Welcome guys. Welcome to my channel. What's well, to our channel. And guys, I'm going to use the Moonology Oracle cards for this new moon. All right. So we're going to see what's coming ahead. <laughs> I like this message that it has inside of the box. It says, let the moon be your guide. I love, love, love this energy. New moon energy, y'all. New moon, new moon energy. Let's see what message we have. If you are new to the channel, welcome. We would love to have you here. Go ahead and click the bell to subscribe so you won't miss out on future videos, okay? So let's see what we have. New moon energy, please. Show me new moon energy. Give me a new moon rating, please, for all signs. New moon. use these cards in a little minute let's see what we get thank you the answers you need are coming and then look at the bottom of the deck new moon a new start is coming ah i love it i absolutely love it the answers you need are coming the answers you need are coming. This new moon, get ready. If there's something that you have doubt about or you're looking for some type of answer to a question, it's just like this new moon, set your intentions on that, on gaining clarity. Some of you are looking for clarity, okay? It's time to take action. It's time to take action action have faith in your dreams i'm so loving this have faith in your dreams okay you know the readings a lot lately have been about you know people who are starting businesses and people who are taking their dreams to the next level like the energy has been extremely extremely dope and i'm here for it I'm completely here for it. Let's see. Give me one more card. What energy is coming for the new moon? So it looks like clarity is getting ready to be. You guys are getting clarity on, on some things. And you're going to get clarity that it's time for you to take action. Okay? All right. We have a win-win outcome. <laughs> a win-win outcome is in the forecast. A win-win outcome is in the forecast. This is like so many cards that's jumping out. I'm only taking one more card. <laughs> one more card, Spirit. Like, it's just so many of them. Your dream needs a practical plan. Okay. You are good enough. You are good enough. Okay. Believe in the impossible. So I'm getting very, a lot of you guys should get a goal book or like a manifestation book, a gratitude book, and jot down your ideas, what you're grateful for, your plans, because I feel like with this new moon, there is some dope energy out there, okay? You're getting clarity on something on whether or not to take action. I feel like it's so time to take action, okay? And you need to understand that you are good enough. You are good enough, okay? You are good enough, period. I haven't used these either. This is the Oracle e-guidebook. Let's see what other messages we get. Please clarify these messages, please. Mm 
clarify this these messages. Knock knock. <laughs> Knock, knock. The universe is saying, look, I got your back. I got your back. We see your vision. Okay. Knock, knock. The answers you need are coming. And then you hear a... Somebody might come, literally come to your door and possibly give you some, give you some knowledge or give you, put some, drop a download on you. Okay. Okay. Universe, are you hear me knocking? A song might play that gives you some clarity. Um, you could be having a conversation with somebody and get some clarity. Like, clarity is here. This is the moment of clarity, okay? Time to fly. When I say it's time to take action, time to fly just came out. Okay, it's time to take off with those goals, those dreams. Look, just do it, okay? Without a plan, without, don't say, oh, don't come up with all these excuses about why you can't do it. Oh, I'm going to wait till next week until, look, go ahead and start preparing. Go ahead to get ready to take flight, okay? Give me one more card. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows everywhere. <laughs> okay, this is clarifying. You are good enough. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows everywhere. Come on now. It don't get no better. It don't get no better. It does not get any better. <laughs> Let's see. What other messages are there for my collective for this new moon energy, guys. What messages are there? We got the Ace of Cups. Three of Cups. The High Priestess and the Wheel of Fortune jumped out together. Okay. It looks like a lot of you guys are moving on or moving on to something better going to some to calmer waters okay some of you guys are also may have a love situation that you have decided to move on okay or you decided to make a decision between two people some of you are like got your guard up okay you got your guard up your 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 guard is up because some of you love really easily, okay? But look, y'all got so many opportunities here. There's a new, there's an opportunity for new love that's coming knocking at your door, okay? Why is the Ace of Cups here? Oh, it looks like, see, look, the Queen of Cups and the Six of Cups. Lots of Cups here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpios, Energy. Oh, with some of you, I'm getting like a husband. King of Cups. Hierophant and the Four of Wands, like, yeah. I'm getting, like, a marriage, okay? Some of you may be getting ready to get married. Um, Some of you may have getting proposed to. But the Queen of Cups and the Ace of Cups, that is a lot of love, okay? The Six of Cups saying this could be someone from the past, okay? You may have thought that you moved on from this person, but this person comes back knocking on your door and pulling at your heartstrings, okay? Um bringing up the past, talking about the past. Mind you guys, you got to keep in mind that we are still in retrograde. Mercury just went retrograde. And you know, a lot of times our exes, you know, like to come back. There's that King of Cups, all cups here. Okay. We got the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups here. Okay. So this could be like a soul mate connection. This is someone I feel like you both really, really do care about each other. Okay. We got the sun at the bottom of the deck, okay? And I'm getting someone deciding to uh, that they made the best decision with the sun and the seven of cups to take some type of risk, okay? We got the fool, okay? I'm getting like there needs to be a decision or you already made a decision because I got the two of pentacles 
and the judgment. That's definitely juggling, you know, trying to make a final decision. But overall, someone here took a risk or someone's trying to decide on whether or not they want to take a risk. And then with that Seven of Cups, there's a lot of offers, a lot of options in front of you. But the Sun card is saying, you know what, look, I'm going to make the best decision. You know, I'm happy with the decision that, you know, I'm going to make. Three of Cups here. Ooh, Six of Wands. Look in the Ten of Wands. There's lots of eyes are getting ready to be on you. Okay, there's going to be a lot of people watching you, like admiring you. It's not like a stalkerish type of watching. It's admiring you. Like you, you guys have a lot of admirers, um, fans or subscribers, um, followers. I'm getting that. Like there's a lot of you guys are getting ready to get a big following. Okay, so if you have like a YouTube channel or you're on Instagram or TikTok, Facebook, it looks like take action because now is the time. Okay, now is the time. Yeah, see, big changes are, are ahead. Okay, but I feel like you intuitively know this, like you feel this, you feel this change coming. Okay, yeah, there's something here as well about a final decision. Now, I got the chariot card as well. There is going to be forward movement, okay? You are taking some type of forward movement, but I got somebody here watching you or you're watching someone, okay? Got the strength card here. It could be a Leo, but I'm just getting like somebody is also waiting for someone to make a final decision. Maybe this Leo is waiting for you to make a final decision, but I'm just getting... I'm getting um, someone's waiting on someone, spying on someone to see if they're going to make a final decision. Um, but overall, guys, the energy that is coming in for the new moon is very great, good energy. Like I'm getting, you know, it is in the sign of Libra. Libra is very, it's a very good energy. You know, it's about balance and harmony and balancing those scales. Um I, I, I can dig it. I can really dig this energy. Like, I feel like you're getting ready to gain clarity about a situation. For a lot of you, it may be in regards to love. Some of you are getting ready to get new love in. Um, it's time to take action. Time to fly. Spirit say it's time to, sh hey, let's take off. We ready to go. Okay, and you are good enough. Like, you're good enough. It's like whatever decision you choose to make, it's not going to phase you, make you feel low about yourself. It's just like a win-win situation, okay? I'm just getting like win-win all the way around the board, all right? So y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And if you would like to book your very own personal reading, you could do so on the website. The website is www.empressempress.com. EmpressEmpireOils.com is in the description box below, and I will chat with y'all later. Ciao.